Hello, this is Eric Wamsley, Systems Engineer with Nutanix, coming at you with a, another short video on how to enable syslogging for your Nutanix environment. I'm going to show you how to enable syslogging and then just what kind of some of the logs to look like. You do have to have a syslog server deployed. It can be either a free or a paid version. Nutanix does not provide you currently with a syslog server. The syslog server does not have to reside on a Nutanix environment. It can be on a physical host, a physical appliance, or a virtual machine in another environment, or a cloud-hosted option. And we do support both UDP and TCP syslogging. Step one is to log into Prism and go to the gear icon in the top right. And then scroll down on the left and we are looking for syslog server, which is right there, it's near the bottom and then you just hit configure syslog server. And in this field, we'll just give the syslog server a name. Mine's pretty simple, syslog. Put the IP address and then the specific port that you use. Mine's a free version, so it only supports UDP, but if you do support TCP, select that and put in that information. Hit the save button. And then all you need to do now is configure the data sources. Data sources are what you want sent to the syslog server such as the Acropolis audit logs, or in like my environment, I'm playing around with flow. So I'm going to enable flow and select that I want the level five or level six logs sent in, and then hit save. And as soon as you hit save and it changes the screen, your syslog server is gonna start receiving logs. So I'll hop over here and you can see it actually refreshed while I was swiping and it's already given us that information. And that's how you enable syslogging with Nutanix through Prism. Thank you very much for watching this video. I hope it was helpful. Please check out my other videos here on YouTube through the channel Eric Wamsley or check out my website, ewams.net. Or of course, you can also follow me on Twitter at ewams. Thank you. Have a good one.